Hey everyone, it's the 11th of November 2022, so day three, uh, well the third day, I think it's probably day five, maybe day, even day six on the Royal Saxon Way. I've left Littlebourne a little while ago behind me, but again, as so often when you get out walking in nature, there's hardly anyone around. It's a car perhaps over there, but apart from that, Although uh, perhaps I'm struck by a hedge over there, not anyone as far as I can see. Which is just, you know, you look for a bit of space and you, you get a lot of space. How often do you kind of uh, get that space in an office or at work or anything really, any other time when you live in the town or you just, you know, it's taken me a drive this morning to get here. Perhaps 35 minutes to get here from my house. I parked up in Littlebourne planning to get to Minster. It might take me about four hours. It's quite a, you know, quite a lot to a long distance, quite a fair way to walk. Um, but of course, there may be things which happen in the way. You never know when you're on a walk what's going to quite happen. I've got a few supplies from the shop, from the store there as well. There's a first church, not even the first church, must I say. Um, I've already walked past the church of Littlebourne. This is Wickhamborough. And uh, it's been really good. Managed to get a bit of cleaning and things done at home earlier. Now I've got some nice time. Back at work tomorrow, unfortunately. Oh, I can't remember the last time I went for a walk three days in a row like this. But really kind of getting the momentum going on the pilgrimage. It's, it's really good. It's one of those things that you kind of miss. It's not as good as you know, camp out and have that solitude and space completely but it's still good I'm just feeling not quite well and happy a little bit of hay fever coming from my nose unfortunately but otherwise feeling really good and as you see another be blessed again with the weather with blue skies here in the Kemp countryside so um Ultrea. Hopefully you can see, so it's just nice, I'm just taking a little pause. And uh, behind me, it's called the Little Stour. Uh, so the Little River, um, part of the river. And it's some dried up plucked scutter where I'll be later on. And it's just really nice, and as you can see, just behind me. I'm just going to take a few minutes here, pause, before I get my way again. It goes without saying that it's just beautiful. I mentioned earlier hardly anyone around. I saw a few walkers a while back, but I've just been walking along what's it, the canal, if you like, <laughs> the river. Certainly for the last mile, maybe a couple of miles. It's really nice. So I know that somewhere over here, in this direction is Minster, so that's Preston to over here, where I've stayed before. So possibly going to retrace some steps I've walked on a trail before. But I think it is a slightly different route. Um, heading for Pluckscutter. I'm in Minster. I know certainly for sure last time when I went from Pluckscutter uh, to Minster, I went definitely the wrong way across the field. Got lost, ended up just taking the roadway. So hopefully I won't do that again. You learn from your mistakes. See, the weather's fantastic. I've got my t-shirt on, quite a garish t-shirt I've got on. Nice uh, run I did a couple of months ago. And it's just great. So just walking along, you stick it out in the background, look at that. So, as I say, just keep going. Um, the bus is going to leave, I think, in about an hour and a half. So it's going to be a little bit of a rush, but I think it's actually going to be perfect timing. So we'll see how it goes, just, just before I checked. And uh, the end of the pilgrimage is close. And uh, perhaps I'll have some final reflections uh, as I get closer to Minster. So I made it literally on the dot. I've seen a bus. I'm hoping he's going to come back round. I'll just basically run for the last bus of the day. Running for ages. Absolute kind of caked. 
blood on my hands, all sorts. Nice to see you now. Fantastic. Okay, pilgrimage over. It's been brilliant. See you later.